I'll be showing you how to set up product tabs for your Shopify store. We'll be using a completely free app, at least it's completely free at the time of recording, and it's called Tabs. It makes it easy to create product page tabs in either a tab format or an accordion format. To note, I don't have any affiliation with this app, but it does have great reviews and it is completely free. So I'll leave a link for this Shopify app in the description below, but once you're on the page, you wanna hit Add App, and once you've installed the app and accepted the permissions, it will bring you to the Tiny Tabs dashboard. So first, let's go and enable the app extension in our theme so we can view our tabs in our store. This will redirect us to our app embeds in our theme here. We can see it's enabled and to actually save that, we'll just go to the top right here and hit save. It gives us some further customization if we want to customize using a CSS selector on where the tabs are going to appear. I'm going to leave the default here and let's go back to the app settings. So now that we've enabled it, let's go to set up product tabs. So it's going to automatically create tabs directly from the product description. And for the heading type, we'll leave this as H5. The default tab title we'll leave as description and we'll include the first tab in the tabs block. So that all looks good there. Let's go to create shared tabs here. We can create tabs for multiple products. So let's go and add our first tab. Let's say this one is gonna be rich text. I'm gonna call this shipping here. I'm gonna go and copy and paste some random text here. And I'm gonna hit save. And I'm gonna hit this to active and I'll hit save again. So this is gonna show up as a shared tab here. So let's go back and let's create one more just for the purposes of this video. Let's say this one's gonna be called returns. Again, I'm just gonna paste that random text here and I'll hit save one more time. I'll also make sure that is active. So now that we've created our shared tabs, you can include whatever information you're looking for. A lot of people include review widgets, shipping information, return policies, basically information the customer would want to see, but you just don't want to overwhelm them at the beginning with all of it. I think it's a great way to include these shared tabs there. So let's go to customize our tabs first. This will be the last setting so we can see how it's going to look. We get customization on the layout. So the default layouts here, let's go to default and colorized. I like how that looks. There's a live preview making it easy to see how it is going to be featured here. We can set whether it's responsive and it can switch automatically to the accordion view based on the device size. You can set the padding, margin, colors, typography, and borders. I'm just going to leave all of these as default here. And I'll just go to save in the bottom right. Now for the final test, let's see how this looks in our store. So I'm going to hover over online store in the left hand side menu. And then I'm going to hover over this eye icon and it's going to say view your online store. It's going to open up my Shopify store and I'm going to scroll down into one of the products. And if I scroll down to the description now, instead of just writing the description here, it's going to display mine in the tabs that I set up. So I have my description. You can see my shipping tab as well as my review tabs. Now this text isn't formatted because there was HTML formatting going into it. So I would probably just write the text, not copy and pasting from this example text, but overall that should look okay. So just like that, I've set up product tabs. You get options on the customization, the colors, the branding, and it is a completely free app, at least at the time of recording. So it's a great option to set up product tabs for your Shopify store. It's also gonna replace any product tabs that were there before. I know the Shopify Dawn theme does have some set up automatically. If you've made any sales on Shopify, you know how hard it is to keep track of how much money your store has actually made. That's where our sponsor Profit Calc comes in. It's the one click profit calculator available for your Shopify store. All you have to do is select the date range you're looking for to get real time calculations so you can understand how much money your store has made. It's going to give you tons of different details metrics and analytics so you can make smarter business decisions for your store it's going to sync seamlessly with different ad accounts such as facebook google snapchat bing pinterest and tiktok as well as many other cost of goods sold integration you can find it in the shopify app store by searching profit calc and looking for this logo in the top left there's also a link in the description below where you can get access to a 15 day free trial so you can test drive everything for yourself so i hope you enjoyed the video on how to set up product tab for your Shopify store. If you did, I would love it if you smash that like and subscribe button below as that really helps the channel out. This is going to conclude the video here, so thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one.